stop playing with him. Jada Vinci and his bitch. Okay. I'm so bad I got him twerking with me and his bitch. Hi guys, welcome and or welcome back to the channel. Jada Vinci here with a super easy beginner friendly hair tutorial. I literally did not glue this wig down. I just don't want to mess it up, but I did not glue this wig down at all like when i mean at all no got to be no spray no no nothing okay this wig is from love me hair this is how the box came presented to you guys i genuinely love love me hair they have some of the best like hair textures this is my second time ordering from this company and i absolutely love their hair okay i'm gonna share with you guys what's in the inside of the box because i did not do that in the end but you do get this beautiful box that i love when you open it up your hair came in like a plastic bag and then it was your hair also comes presented to you guys in this little love me hair package they do give you some goodies give you a little love me hair let's just open it up extra elastic band some bobby pins and then one of those okay you guys i love these things because these are easier to sleep with than elastic bands so like when you're gonna wear your wig overnight these are just easier to sleep with a little more comfortable to sleep with so i love that i love me hair clip it's like rhinestoned out and then an edges brush and then you get some tweezers things to know about breast cancer okay that's that's amazing do give you a wig cap and then it tells you how to actually care for your hair how to do a return and a refund if you want to do that so other companies that i've ordered from they don't like give you all of that stuff um, so I personally like when companies go out of their way to do that. So now let's just hop into this video. I'm going to show you guys how I did this glueless install and how I defined my curls. So let's just hop straight into it. So you guys, we are going to be installing this wig from Love Me Hair. This is a 22 inch. Let me show you guys what the inside looks like. As you guys can see, I did bleach the knots. They do have where you can make it glueless. So maybe we'll attempt to make it glueless. Four combs, two on the side, one in the middle, one in the back, adjustable strap. And this time you guys, the lace is actually really short. <laughs> I didn't cut it, it came to me like this. This is what the hairline is looking like. I did not pluck it at all. I do like the lace, it's definitely very transparent as you guys can see. Let me just glue, zoom in for y'all. So this is what the lace looks like. It looks really good. So you guys, in the box, they did give us a like elastic band that's going to help make it glueless. Put it on, just like a bra. You just literally put it on. Ooh, it fits nice and snug, y'all. That's pretty. So as always, I'm gonna just cut a few slits. So we don't really have to go too ham because um, they kind of already cut off a bunch of the lace for you so we're going to be very careful right very careful okay so now all i'm doing is i'm going in with a bit of my uh, face powder just for the excess lace that is still here um because there is a little bit of lace and i like to keep a little bit of lace just for like security okay you just place it where you want but let me show you guys what we're going to do we're gonna style it all right so we are gonna part it in part to the middle so this is what it looks like air dried hair as you guys can see i did pre-wash it i will put some water in so we can have more of like a sleek look it is 22 inches and it does go all the way down when you are to pull it down but this is what the hair looks like you guys so we are going to just spray the hair because we just need um just oh shit that was a horrible mistake all right Bling brush oh look at the curls So just look at the difference. This side is so defined and it's really pretty. Granted, if you like a big, bold hairstyle, you can definitely go with this side, but let's just define this side real quick. This is how the hair turned out. As you guys know from watching the tutorial, I did not 
glue it down. I didn't got to be glue it down. I just literally used the band that it came with because I wanted this to be a nice, easy, like one of my go-to throw on wigs, you know what I mean? It's long, it's giving gorgeous. When I say you need to bleach your knots, I'm gonna always recommend that whenever you have a human hair wig, bleach your knots, it's going to just make uh, your install look that much better and you're gonna love it just a hundred times more, you know what I mean? I love, love me hair. Granted, the hairline, you can definitely get some parting space. So you got about that much of parting space on the side. The last love me hair I had, it was more frontal, so you can do more with uh, the parting space. As you guys can see here, I think this might be like a 13 by four. Granted, this 13 by four is still giving very scalp. -y. If I wanted to do a side part, I could manage the side part to about here. So it, it still gives you a lot of wiggle room when it comes to styling the hair. As you guys can see, I just defined the curls with my Miss Jessie's uh, curling products and I think that it is, go <laughs> I think it's gorgeous. It's super soft, definitely didn't tangle. When I was washing the hair, I didn't get any tangles either. So I personally just love when companies give you grade A hair, okay? This is beautiful. When I mean this is like an everyday go-to throw on hair, this is a go-to throw on hair. Granted, when it is to dry, I think it's gonna be super cute. These curls are magical. If you've been looking for like a super kinky curly hair, this is for you. The last curly, kinky curly hair that I did, it was less kinky, it was like a Brazilian texture, uh, but this is just giving like hair goals. You know what I mean? I always want my hair to look like this because it's not, it's not like a, a coarse texture, it's really fine. The curls are really soft, definitely easy to define. When you're dealing with curly hair, you definitely need to get you a defining brush. I'll link some below in case you guys are interested, but I 100% think that you need a defining brush when it comes to curly hair and some type of hair product. You don't have to use Miss Jessie, Miss Jessie's a little more on the expensive side. You can definitely go that Cantu route because Cantu has lit products for like weaves, but you guys, I am here for it. I think it's super gorgeous. The hairline just looks so good. Um, I didn't have any tangling, like I didn't have any real tangling, which I was surprised by because I did cut the ear tabs off. And typically like when I start cutting the hair, um, I do experience some type of shedding. I didn't experience any shedding after I was done bleaching the knots. I didn't experience any shedding. The knots bleached beautifully. If I ever did want to actually like color the hair, it would be amazing. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick video. I actually did not do any baby hairs, any anything like that. I just wanted to keep it super beginner friendly for you guys. If you guys are feeling a little you know, it was windy in your town, definitely slick some baby hairs down with some got to be and your wig would not go anywhere. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe to my channel, and I'll catch you on my next video. Bye. If another motherfucking bitch try to try me, they gonna have to find me. They gonna be on an IV. I'ma have them on the run like Jan Beyonce.